Recently, the creator of Unreal Engine, Tim Sweeney, joined a podcast where he talked for four hours straight about the creation of Unreal Engine and what's coming next. Among the many things he discussed, one in particular caught everyone's attention. Unreal Engine 6 is using a brand new programming language called Verse. C++ code has to be compiled externally using software like Microsoft's Visual Studio. But with this new change, game creators will be able to write code using the new language directly inside the engine. Verse is still new and an early version is already being tested in Unreal Engine Editor for Fortnite but that's just a test version. The full implementation coming with Unreal Engine 6 is expected to solve many of the problems faced by today's game development industry. One of those problems is the way blueprints, Unreal's visual scripting system, are handled. When blueprints were introduced, they were built on top of C++, which caused a bit of mess set up behind the scenes. Now they will be implemented from the ground up to run better and integrate more smoothly, without the old performance issues. Verse, it's been designed to be simple, modern and easy to use, even for people who have never programmed before. Another huge point here is, according to Tim Sweeney, Unreal Engine 6 will let you publish your game to any platform without massive adaptation. Once you've made your game, exporting it to other platforms should be much easier. Today, that's one of the most complex parts of making games. Also, features like Nanite, Lumen and others that were introduced in Unreal Engine 5 will come fully integrated and improved, no longer experimental, but mature and ready to use. This makes Unreal Engine 6 feel solid and powerful right from the start. All of these together means UE6 could truly change the game. You have top tier visuals running in real time inside a clean and rebuilt environment using brand new programming language. No plugins, no extra tools. You won't need to wait for long compiles anymore, everything just works fast and direct. This could remove huge barriers for people who want to make games, opening the door for amazing new titles and on all kinds of platforms. Now, maybe the most surprising detail, Unreal Engine 6 will be built from the ground up to take full advantage of modern multi-core processors. Today, most engines run key systems on just one CPU core. That means if you have a powerful computer with many cores, only one is doing the heavy lifting. That creates a performance bottleneck. Unreal Engine 6 will fix this by automatically handling background tasks across multiple cores. This means much better performance. To put it simply, instead of 100 AI characters, you might now be able to run 1000, just because the engine uses all available CPU power. And according to Tim Sweeney and his team, that's exactly what they are working on. And look how crazy this is, this will first impact story-based or local games. Online games still need to deal with server limitations and internet data transfer, but Tim has said many times that Unreal Engine 6 is focused on open worlds and the metaverse, so it's only a matter of time. I'm leaving the full podcast interview on the description, and if you want to dive deeper into this, check the description for my tutorial series where I show you how to build systems using Unreal Engine. We're starting now with Unreal Engine 5, which is already laying the foundation for Unreal Engine 6. Thank you so much for watching, big hugs, see you next time. Bye bye.